This is AS stats. We are on unit four and we're in 4.4 looking at complementary events all within probability. So it says here we know that the probability of A not occurring is expressed as A with a wee line above it or A prime. This is known as the complement of the event. For, a, for example, I can read if event A is getting a six when you throw, throw a dice, then a with a line over it is not getting a 6 when you throw a dice. And obviously the probability of A plus the probability of not A equals 1. We've known that for a long time. Sometimes it can be easier to find the probability by first finding the probability of the complementary event. For example, let A be the event of getting at least one 6 when you throw a dice 5 times. Therefore, the probability of not A will be the event of getting no sixes when you throw a dice five times. To calculate the probability of A, it is much it will be much simpler to calculate the probability of not A first and then use the probability of A plus the probability of not A equals one, or the probability of A equals one minus the probability of not A, or the probability of at least one six equals one minus the probability of getting no sixes. So generalize then is going to be the probability of greater than or equal to 1 equals 1 minus the probability of 0. Let's take a wee look then at example 4. So what we're going to do is we're going to let A be the first throw. And B be the second throw. It's worth saying that clearly A and B are independent, as in you know that one's not affected by the other. And also then not A and not B are also independent. So for part A, neither throw results in a four. Probability of not A and not B is equal to the probability of not A multiplied by the probability of not B is equal to 5 6 multiplied by 5 6 and that gives us 25 over 36. It's neither as a 4. So not a 4 here is 5 6, not a 4 here is 5 6. So we end up with that. For part B at least one. So that would be the probability of both or the probability of A and not B or the probability of not A and B. That's quite awkward to work out. That's why it's easier using this rule of six, which I'm going to show the um, the previous option for in a wee, sec wee second. So a four and a four is a six times a six plus a six times five six, or sorry, added to five six times. A sixth. That gives us one over thirty six plus five over thirty six plus five over thirty six, which is eleven over thirty six. The other way of doing this, which is much easier, it's one minus the probability of not A and 
Oh, C. As well as, let's see, inverse of that part A, effectively. And that's 1 minus 25 over 36. And that's 11 over 36. And as you can see, the second way is just a handier way than I've worked in that way. 